vlogtober day 20 yay 11 more days i can't wait <laughs> I'm telling y'all now, honey, your girl will not be vlogging every day in November. November is my birthday, and I'm be taking it real, real easy. I'm still gonna be vlogging for y'all. Um, excuse those clothes, they just came out the dryer. Y'all know I be doing a million things. Let me get them out of my I don't like that view. There we go. That's better. Um, what was I saying? Oh, November. Yeah. So, um, I'm still going to be vlogging, but I'm going to take November to just enjoy my birthday, get prepared for Thanksgiving. Y'all know I do catering, so I have catering orders that I have to get done um, and then cook for my family because I didn't cook last year because my birthday was actually on Thanksgiving. I cooked, but just a little bit. I didn't like cook, cook. This year I'm a cook, cook for my family and other family. I ain't gonna say everybody else's family because I've only taken a few, a few orders. Um, because I don't want to wear myself out. My birthday is the day after Thanksgiving, which is Black Friday. Yeah, so. um, Y'all remember I showed y'all my little book that I got? I said, oh, I ain't been reading the, um, the family nothing. Um... I'm trying to find this one that I read last night. It was really, really good. Um, I like this little book. Walmart, I don't know if y'all Walmart has it, but my Walmart has this um, new um, like book section. And they have Bibles, they have um, all types of things, Bibles and um, different like inspirational books. And they're like 25% off. Um, when I go back in there, I'll try to show y'all, but that's where I got this book from. Um, this one is called Growing Trust. And it says, I pray that Christ will be more and more at home in your hearts, living within you as you trust in him. May your roots go down deep into the soil of God's marvelous love. And may you be able to feel and understand, as all God's children should, how long, how wide, how deep, and how high his love really is. And a scripture reference for that is Ephesians 3, 17 through 19. Then it says, trust in the promises of God is a process that takes time. When you have a relationship with Jesus, the Holy Spirit dwells within you, guiding and encouraging you. As your relationship grows stronger, your love grows as well. With greater love comes greater trust as you see God's faithfulness day by day. As your trust grows, the roots of your faith will be built on his abounding love and perfect promises. If you are struggling to trust God's faithfulness, begin reading his word throughout the day. Speak to him, asking the Holy Spirit within you for guidance. Let his words of love be your constant companion and support. And it just has a little prayer. Heavenly Father, I pray for a fuller understanding of your great love for me. I want to be consumed by your love and faithfulness, putting all my trust in you. So I thought that that was very much needed. Um, it seems like, like this book has days in it. Let me show you. So like, see, like January 16th, 17th. But I never go by the days. I just kind of 
look at the title and relate it to what I'm going through at that moment. Um, and I read it and I study on that. Um, and I usually study the scripture or whatever, but um, that one spoke to me because I've been dealing a lot and pondering a lot on faithfulness and having faith that must receive faith, which is just a little bit. So it does not require much, just a little bit. And I have really been trying to just write down stuff. Um, my, one of my favorite scriptures I have it written on my board is Habakkuk 2, um, 2 through 3. And it's write the vision and make it plain upon tables. So when you think something, even if you think that it's not accomplishable, or if you if something is trying to hold you back from getting to that level, and I'm speaking to myself, so but I'm talking to y'all. <laughs> um, write it down. You know, write it down. Put it on paper. If you can think it, you can achieve it angel talking to myself but i'm just telling y'all so yeah i just want to share that with y'all this morning um the kids are off to school taylor was tired because she had cheer competition yesterday game tomorrow y'all already know what i'm doing working yep working and folding clothes and washing and doing what I do. Um, yeah, so I hope y'all have a good Thursday. It is almost Friday. We are there at the weekend. You can just see it. Come on, Friday. Um, but yeah, so I hope y'all have been enjoying the videos. I have been trying to give y'all content that is not like super boring. Um, but when you're vlogging daily, it's just really lifestyle vlogs. Like, this is what I do on a day-to-day -day basis. You know, I may go out or do, like, something fun in between. But vlogging every day, you're going to get real life. And that's just what this is. It's real life. So, I hope y'all have been enjoying it. I'm really, really, really excited for Vlogmas because Christmas is my that's my thing. That's that's me. I love Christmas. Even before YouTube, I've always decorated. I go over the top. I do little stuff for my kids. Like, I'm real extra when it comes to Christmas. When my mom was living and she was in a nursing home, I used to decorate her room, her door. They used to be like, oh. And then when I started decorating her door, they started making it a thing, like a little door contest. But that's just me. I love Christmas. I love it. So, um, yeah, got some exciting things coming up. Um, thank you to all of my new subscribers. Welcome to the Jacobs fam. We're so happy that you are here. Tell a friend, girl. Share it. Share the page. Tell a friend. We are on the road to 1K and beyond. Us. Me and you. Me and all of us. Because we're family. But, yeah, um... I love y'all, and I hope y'all have a good Thursday, and I will see y'all in the next vlog. Bye.